Good morning, family, and welcome to today's Lessons for Life. Today is Thursday, October 23rd, 2008, and today we're reading Genesis chapter 24, where Abraham is getting older in age, he's getting up there, and he wants to find a wife for his son Isaac, so he speaks to his elder servant and he says, you know, he gives him certain criteria that he wants him to find his wife for his son, and he sends the servant off. And... Uh, what stuck out to me as a, a good lesson that we can learn from this chapter is basically the criteria or, that this servant used in order to find the right woman for Isaac. So what happens, the servant goes by where the young ladies will go and fetch water and he stays there and he says that he's going to ask one of them for water and whoever brings him water, gives him water and also not only gives him but his camel's water would be the one that he would uh, choose for Isaac. Uh, and what I see as important as that is he's really testing the character of this lady by seeing how much uh, service she would actually provide for him. By seeing the level of service that she would provide not only for him but also seeing that his camels need the water as well. So that's an important lesson for us to learn because I think it's a lot, it's very backwards to what we uh, traditionally thought or taught that service is like uh, the people who provide service are like the lowest people or, or something along that nature. But if you think about even the owner of a business or a company, that that person that's the most important is not only the one that makes the decision, but the one that will provide the, the greatest level of service for the customer or for the client. Because a business is not in, in business to really make themselves happy, but they're actually in business to make others happy make their clients happy and that's how the business prospers and that's how the business flourishes because if the business just makes themselves happy and everyone else is miserable then that business will not continue to keep growing because you need the customers in order to um, support the business anyway uh, so that service is is of utmost importance in that level and even if I'm thinking uh, even as I was working in the corporate world so to say the person that would excel and continue to rise up to different levels and different levels was the one that was providing the greatest level of service and meeting the um, the expectations or the needs of the you know bosses and so forth but was serving in that capacity so service is really of utmost importance in our everyday lives and we have to keep that in mind that the serving is actually not um, a lower level but actually the serving is one of the highest levels that there is to be able to serve someone else and to be able to, that's actually what even ministering is, is to serve. So uh, that's what I wanted to share with you for today. There's a lot of other stuff, like I said, as always, continue to read through the rest of the chapter and um, create yourself a wonderfully blessed day today. Find an opportunity to serve someone, see how you'll get blessed in return because there's definitely a blessing in service just like how Rebecca was blessed in her service by becoming Isaac's wife. And create yourself a blessed day, and we will talk again tomorrow.